Are you one of those people who relies on a GPS to get around? Let me ask you a question. Have you ever tried navigating without a GPS? Maybe you're driving, going somewhere along the way you're not familiar with. And then all of a sudden, your GPS system or your phone just shuts off. And the next thing you know, you're all along trying to figure your way out. What's the next thing you'll do? Will you stop the car and will you stop walking? And will you just stop everything and wait there and continue to feel lost? Or will you try to look up for the signs to try and guide you? Because that's exactly what we're going to be doing in today's magic practice. In life, the universe actually gives us a lot of signs. Or we can call these things cues. We just aren't aware of them. This might sound quite woo-woo to some of you guys, but I want you to imagine this. Imagine that the universe is someone who is very caring, who looks out for you, who loves you, and it's just looking out for you all the time. And it wants you to have everything you ever wanted in life. But the thing is, the universe can't just walk straight up to you and hand you the thing that you want in life. But what it does is it uses signs, it uses certain cues. Because the universe knows that you need to use gratitude to bring forward the things that you want into your life. So it uses the people, the events, the circumstances surrounding your day as cues and as signs for you to be grateful and really you can think of it in some examples like these if you hear an ambulance siren the magic sign from the universe is for you to be grateful for your health and if you see a police car the universe wants you to be grateful for the safety and security that you have in your country if you see someone reading a newspaper it's your sign to be grateful for the great news that you're going to be receiving for the day and if now you're single and you want romantic love to be attracted to you if you see a couple then it's the universe's sign for you to be grateful for the perfect partner that is coming along your way if you want to have a family and, and you start seeing babies and children, then it's your sign to be grateful for children. When you pass by an ATM or a bank, it's your sign to be grateful for money. If you come across someone who is really happy, it's your sign to be grateful for happiness. If you come across someone saying thank you, it's your magic sign to say thank you. When you get home, it's your magic sign to start being grateful for your home. And when you say hi to your neighbours along the way, it's your sign to be grateful for your neighbours. When you begin a new day and somebody says good morning to you, it's your sign to be grateful for a new day and that you're alive. These are some of the ways that the universe uses signs to cue you to be magically grateful for the things you have in your life or the things that you desire. So in today's practice, it's simple. All you have to do is to take seven different cues from the universe today. It could be anything like the above examples I mentioned and the list is not exhaustive. Whatever it is that you experience in your life that you encounter, choose seven different things that you encounter today to be grateful for. You know, one of the many benefits of gratitude and playing this game of the magic cues is that it helps you become more aware of what you already have in your life and in turn the more aware and the more alert you become the more grateful you become and the more easily you attract your dreams so that's all for today's practice day 25 we have three more days to go before the end of the magic practice i look forward to seeing you in the next video thank you for watching bye